Yep, this is the compound. Hi. I'll drop you off. Who is that? Can I kill it? Oh, wait, what? No, 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 no. no. Oh, dude, why did you... Why did... <laughs> what is up, the world? It is your friendly neighborhood slip gator here. <laughs> Hanging out today, doing stuff and things. Looking for the elusive giganto Tecapithecus. And I have found one. He is an amazing level eight. What a specimen. Notice the buttocks. Quite flat. Almost a brack. Just a back and a crack. Not much going on there. He's pretty hot looking though. So we're going to try to tame him. <coughs> Excuse me. I can't wait. I hope you guys are having a great day. I'm having a really good day. I've been looking around for one of these guys for a long, 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 long time. Actually, to be honest with you, I found an Alpha Raptor, an Alpha Carno, and an Alpha T-Rex before I found this Gigantotecopithecus. It is uh, quite an elusive creature, the Gigantotecopithecus. And um, yeah, but we found one now, so we're going to try to tame him. So we, we did this in the last video. We were talking with uh, Mazion and Zul'jin about how to get this guy. So you got to come up behind him. Bam, fed him, nailed that ace, stick, heavy stop. So what you do is you got to put some medjo berries in your uh, zero slot, and then what you do is you run up behind him and you squirt him up his butt, okay? So that's how it's done. You just squirt them right up his butt, and then you do that several times till his butt is full of berries, and then he's like, he gets really excited about that, I guess, and then he loves you. So that's what we're going to do. You can feed him about every 10 to 20 seconds-ish, and you got to be careful. Wait till I'm hungry. All right, he's not hungry yet. So you got to be careful about his line of sight. So if he sees you, he'll aggro, which we do not want. We do not want aggro Gigantotecopithecus um, at all. So we definitely want to make sure you come at him from behind. Now, there's been a bunch of stuff I was reading online. Wow, this guy doesn't get hungry as fast as the other guy we were playing around. Oh, no, he aggroed me. Great. Worst thing that ever happened. If he aggroes you, well, I heard they turned his aggro range down. But if he takes any damage, it will reset the tame. So he cannot take any damage. Okay, guys? So if you take, we do not want that more than anything. That is the worst. So, um, yeah, no damage can be taken. Um, and, yeah, I'm going to continue to put some berries in his butt. I'll be our bees, peeps. And we're back. And there's our elusive Giganto Tecapithecus right there. And look. There's another one. I can't believe it. Like, I can't tell you how amazingly rare these guys are, guys. They're very, very, very rare. Like, super hard to find. So to find two of them at once, it kind of has blown my, my noodle a little bit. Well, we're going to try to tame them both. I mean, you got to wait a little bit between each one as they um, as they eat food and whatever. Or they get need to get hungry. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Oh, my gosh. They, like, they, like, all spin around and stuff all the time. You have to be really careful. There's almost no, like guaranteed really good time to get one as far as like to get behind it they seem to spin all the time like that um so all right let's go up to this guy put it up his butt is he aggroed onto me why i wasn't even no see this is weird no he's coming all right we gotta go get on our bird and break aggro so that's what i've been doing to break aggro oh no 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 we can't oh this is bad oh he's gonna hit me oh he hit me where are you foul mouth Leave me alone, yo. Just leave me alone, man. I don't I don't want to be no. Oh my oh my gauntlet's broke. <laughs> no, leave me alone, dude. Just leave me alone, yo. I don't wanna hurt you. I don't wanna have to kill you, man. Okay? I don't wanna have to hurt you. Getting them both in close proximity would be bad as well. We don't want that. Um I lost the other guy already. I don't see where he went. Alright. Nope, I don't see him at all. Alright, so we're gonna continue to do this. Hopefully we'll be able to get at least one. And then we'll be our beast peeps. And we're back. Taming the elusive Gigantotecopithecus. And uh, interesting fun fact, it looks like they don't aggro against dinos in your tribe. So, like, tame dinos? They don't aggro against them. Which is interesting, because they aggro against players. So that seems a little bit weird and neato. But, um, alright, where I'm having trouble, they, they wander quite a bit. So you really have to keep an eye on them. And then we got, like, oh, he's going to attack that dilo. Oh, no, 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 no! If he takes the dilo... If he takes damage from the Dilo, is that going to reset his tame? Oh, man. I don't know if passive or, like, uh, dino damage is going to reset the tame or not. Um, if it does, that's going to stink. Um, let's see. Let's go. Oh, man. I can't. Oh, man. 
Is he bloody too? Let's see here. Let's see if we can get our boy. Okay, that tame's good. Oh, crap, crap, crap. Then they're both aggroed onto me. Uh, I think the other team was reset. I couldn't see it. Um, so, all right, let's grab foul mouth here. Get on the bird. Fly up in the air. Diagro. We'll check it again here in a second and uh, continue to tame and lose all of our armor. He <laughs> BRBs peeps. And we're back with the most ridiculously frustrating process of all time. Taming a Giganto Tachypithecus. Um, anytime a Dillo attacks one or anything is in the area, they aggro. Um, and it resets the tame. It is really, really frustrating. They wander all around. Like, it's tough, guys. It's tough. So, um, yeah, I did uh, I did double check that, or I did test that, or after um, I'd stopped recording last time. Um, if they take any damage, it resets their tame. Um, and with their way that they wander, I mean, they wander pretty far. Um, I've been trying to keep the area clear as best I can, but... It's just really, really difficult. Um, it can make it very rewarding, but very, very difficult. Um, I don't know if you could... I'm sure there'd be like maybe a way where you could build a trap or something like that. Um, the frustrating part for me so far, the really biggest frustrating part is like this guy right here. Oh, wait, I got him! Wait, no, that's... What is going on? Hold on. Hold on. What are we going to name him? Harry. Let's just name him Harry. I know it's I know it's cheesy. Harry and the Hendersons. We got one. Wait, now. All right. So this doesn't make any sense. Last time, maybe this guy didn't get hit. He was just in a fight with a Dilo, and I'm pretty sure he got hit. I'm going to have to read up on it. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I don't know where we got him, but we got Harry. What's up, man? Oh, my gosh. You know what? It does make it so much more, like, rewarding when you do get one. Because it's, like, ridiculously difficult. Where did the other guy go? Where did you go, Larry? Oh, there's a raptor right there. You want some of this? Wait, <laughs> you want some of this? Are you dead? You're just a dead, alive raptor. Okay. Oh, oh, uh, Harry's following us. All right, come on, Harry. Yep, I know. We're going to be best friends forever, man. I can't wait. All right, so... Let's move back over to here. We got to find... Is this a lady dude? No, that's the male. The other one is a lady dude, uh, or a lady lady. Let's go ahead and see if we can't find her. I don't know where she went. She's got to be over here in this sort of lead direction somewhere. Anybody see a lady? An attractive young lady around here? And we're back, and some very odd Gigantopithecus behavior is happening here. This one is not aggroing me um, at all. And I think this is the lady from before... Um, I lost her for a little while while I was looking around while I got hairy. I got really excited. I think this is her. But like I said, it doesn't aggro me. It's like... She knows that we're going to be friends forever. Oh, okay. No, she doesn't know anything. She has no idea we're going to be friends forever. So what we're going to do is try to drag her down on the beach a little bit. Where's Harry? There he is. Now, she shouldn't attack him while she's not aggro. If she just sees him passively, uh, she should not attack him. So we're going to bring him down here. All right. All right. I thought I had lost her. I thought I had lost her. This is this is an emotional roller coaster. I'm telling you right now. This is an emotional roller coaster. Rubber banding makes it tough, too. Also, it seems that it's easiest. They kind of, once they start to walk, they do walk in a straight line. Um, um, the other thing I was finding, too, is that it seems like the initial time you feed them, once... It takes like a minute or so, or maybe a little bit more than that, for them to get hungry. After that, they seem to get hungry. See? They seem to get hungry like every 15 or 20 seconds. It's kind of odd. Like, they don't eat, they don't eat, they don't eat, and then they'll start to kind of go ape. <laughs> go ape? It's crazy. These jokes are bananas. All right. Um, I'm going to try to get this lady, and then we're going to have a mate-boosted pair. I'll be our bees, peeps. And we're back, finding out some sort of other weird new Giganto uh, dynamic. It looks like this one's taking some damage somehow. Now, it says I can't feed it till it's hungry again. And I've been trying to feed it off and on now for, like, I fed it initially. And then it's been, like, I don't know, 20 minutes I've been waiting. And it won't, like, get hungry again, air quotes. 
So I don't know exactly what's going on there. It might be that it needs to, like, regain all of its health. I don't know. Maybe before it'll allow you to tame it, like, or something. It's definitely really, really odd. Um, this mechanic seems weird to me. Like, I think it's definitely more, like, more of a an active thing than um, knocking something out and just waiting around. See, it's still hungry. Um, but it's really, really tough. And um, unfortunately for this guy, I don't think... Oh, no. Are you going to attack Harry? You better not. Let me drag you right over here, yo. It's definitely better than, like, having to, I, I guess, like, sit around. I don't know. I don't know if I'd rather just sit around... Or if I'd rather have to do this little mini game thing. Part of me thinks I'd just rather just sit around. Then you can like watch YouTube videos or something about Ark uh, while you're waiting. Um, so I think we're going to abandon this lady. She's not working out. We got Harry. I feel pretty good about it. And the next thing, the next part of this is that we've got to get him back to our base. Which is going to be kind of amazing. Um, I don't want to kill this little lady or anything like that. Maybe she'll heal up and somebody else can find her. Yeah, but it's definitely like she doesn't want to eat food. She's not in she doesn't want any dinner right now, not at all. Um, um, so what up, Harry? What do you got for statistics, homie? 800 health, 390 stim. He's not that great. You know, he's just a starter. He's just a little guy. He's just a little starter guy. Oh, but you know what we do gotta do, man? We gotta put this T-Rex bone out. Wait, what? Oh, we gotta put the T-Rex bone helmet on the helm. So we can't do that yet. Uh we'll have to get a helm. Alright. Uh let's get this guy to follow. Oh my gosh. All right, we got him. And we're going to head to the compound and then we're going to walk all the way over to the to the base. This is going to be quite a little adventure, peeps. And we're back under the cover of night. We're repairing some stuff and things here, getting our armor all fixed up. Luckily, we had some metal that we uh I think had in my base over there from the other day we were over here doing stuff and I brought some over cuz we needed some repairs done. Let's go ahead and do that, and then let's get this ramshackle flak helmet going. Craft that item, yo. We need to get Harry. I'm going to rename him, by the way. I've already decided. We're going to get Harry some stuff and things here, so let's head out. Let's turn it into... It's fixing to be day. Let us go ahead and stick this on his head. Wait, no. Stick this on his head. What does he look like? Oh, baby! He looks so amazing! That looks cool, man. I like it. Just I like the helmet. What does he look like with the... Rex bone skin helmet on. Wait, no. Oh, wait. Um, wait, do we have to? Can we go like this and then do it? Yeah, okay. Nail the dice. The can be stopped. Oh, man. Look how cool it looks. We got to rename him, though. Change name. Chuck. You know why we're going to name him Chuck? Because he chucks you. <laughs> that's why we're going to name him Chuck. <laughs> Silly. Of course, that's why we're going to name him Chuck. We got the Rex bone skin helmet on him. Look how amazing he looks. He looks intelligent. <laughs> Oh, I love you too, Chuck. Are you smart? Are you smart? Oh, he looks at you, doesn't he? Oh, he does. Oh, he has a smart. He's so smart. Look how smart Chuck is. What if I turn around, Chuck? Will you turn around? What if I look at your butt? Right in your butt. What do you got there, buddy? You know, these guys don't have any twigs and bears. There's no twigs and bears on these guys. Good call, Ark. So, he looks at you. This is a pretty amazing thing. So, like I was saying, we got to get him back to base. Now, I was riding him and having Foul Mouth follow for a while. I changed it up and had Foul Mouth follow, and then I rode him. Um, I'm a little concerned to ride him, like, solo. Um, I don't know. Maybe we do need to go on that adventure. Maybe we do need to just follow, have him come, and then have Foul Mouth follow, and then we'll make it all the way back to the base. And we're back! And, uh, actually, we're not gonna take the guy over to the base real quick, because somebody just logged onto the server. Uh, the Minecraft and Hermitycraft people know Corrales, but some of you guys haven't met Corrales yet. He's a really, really awesome guy, great YouTuber, and he's gonna be playing with us here on the Ark server. So, uh, we already came over, I went and, uh, recorded a little bit with him, and I wanted to show you guys what we did. Look, he's gathering his stuff and things up! Look, he does a little kick move. <laughs> it's like a little dance move! Oh! So anyway, yeah, we did a little bit of recording. I wanted to show you guys what we did. So we want to give a warm welcome to Corrales uh, in the comments section. But yeah, check it out, peeps. What is up, the world? It is your friendly neighborhood Slipgator here. Hanging out today, doing stuff and things. And we got a new guy on the server. Help. Help. 
Let me save Hello. you, Corrales. Dude. Hi. Hey, what's up, man? Holy crap. Look at you being off, Mr. Beefcake. Tiny is a big man. It's you. That's my character's name is Tiny. I'm Corrales. Hi. Hey, Corrales. How, how, how do you... Holy crap. Tiny are... is a big man. <laughs> Dude, it kind of looks like I missed leg day for some reason. I know it. Oh, let me see that. Let me see. <laughs> Dude, you're all upper body, man. You're all upper body. That's all you got. So you good. I do have second tits for reasons I know. <laughs> <laughs> Let me look, see. Look, look at me from side. They're not. They're just huge. Yeah, they're just huge. You just got huge packs, man. Huge packs. Dude, I'm level up for reasons I know. How do I do? <laughs> I. Oh, dude. Yeah, I got a. I got a new level. Dude, you know what? I'm super happy to be here. Super thrilled. I haven't been playing video games for two months almost. So this is kind of like, yay, video game. Yeah, man, it's awesome. It's good to have you here. This is really fun, too. Ark is a great game, man. I pooped on the ground. Did you poop yet? Well, I can pick it up. Can I eat it? Dude, you just ate my poop? No, I got human feces. Can, let me just put, drag it down the hill. Oh, you just threw poop. You're a poo thrower. Oh, can, can, I, can you eat it, though? No, you can't eat poops. Thankfully, oh. <laughs> you can't eat poop. What, what would you put poop, poop, poop packages? What's I'm just this? dropping some garbage on the ground I don't need. Okay, I just picked it up. Garbage is good. You, know, you got some you know garbage how, now. You know how you start a game <laughs> where is gathering involved? You gather all the crap. Yeah, Even yeah. If you don't need it, like your DayZ, you know, all the empty tin cans. I need to have them in the beginning. Yeah, man, you, you need it all. Out, I, had, I don't really need it. Dude, is this your bird? This is my bird, foul mouth. Get it? Foul mouth? <laughs> <laughs> can I jump on it? Yeah, yeah, you can jump on it. Why is it the foul mouth, though? Well, foul is like another word for bird, like birds. Mm -hmm. And then it's a double entendre. It means two things. But let's get you somewhere a little bit safer. I have, I just, this is safe for me. Uber, oh, picking up. Are you so kidding? we'll take you. <laughs> <laughs> this is your first you ride on the bird, isn't it? I haven't done anything in the game. I just spawned in, dude. So this is our shark oh. pen right here. Look at the fishes. Yeah, that's where we some we used to keep some fish over there, but we're gonna go over to the compound, which is like where our main starter base area is on the map. Okay, okay, this is this is a safe area though, safe haven. Even. Yeah, we need to get you to a safe area, so that's where we're gonna go first and uh, get you a safe Dude. spot. Maybe get you some armor and stuff like that. I see dinos. I see huts. Oh, he's loading. Something do, 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 is loading. Do, 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 do. All right, well, this, there is the it is. this is this is the compound. This is the base of operations, right? Yep, this is the compound. I'll drop you off. Who is that? Can I kill it? Oh wait, what? No, 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 no. Oh dude, why did you why did <laughs> <laughs> Oh dude? You silly silly man. I, I, uh, <laughs> How funny you said it was a safe haven. It is a safe haven as long as you don't attack the giant uh gorillas and uh have I thought it was an butt. NPC. <laughs> no, we gotta get you into the tribe first, but um Oh. We, you weren't in the tribe yet. I was gonna. I was gonna have you join the tribe just now, uh, but yeah, that happened. So can uh, you respawn it at the? No, you can't use the beds yet, can you? Let's do this first. I'm going to invite you to the tribe. There. Now you should be able to hold E on me. It's a huge poop. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Hold E on me. Zed. Or E on you. And uh, you should be able to. Join Press Z to Poop is the name of the tribe. Recruit to new tribe. Uh, no, 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 no. Access. Hold on. There you go. Wait. Kraus, join Press Z to Poop. All right, sweet. Now Yay! you're in the tribe. So basically, I can punch everything here and nothing will kill me. Nothing will attack you now. Okay, so if I punch this guy again. No. Oh, yeah. That's awesome. Chuck. Hey, be careful. This is Chuck, man. Is that you? Okay, you can ride Chuck. Yeah, you heard him. Don't hurt Chuck. And I you love know this game already. You know yeah, why he's yeah, called Chuck? Yeah. Tell me. Because ah! he chucked you. Crap, that's amazing. Try it, man. Hey, hold, push E to get on him. Uh, right. And then I'm on him. Right, right mouse button to get chucked. Ah! <laughs> 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 it's awesome. Dude, so, okay, this is the main base. This is what I need to know. This is the main base. Main base area right here. 
the forge is here. We got a little a generator thing. right here. Powers this light. We need that big thing just to power this little light here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I even make sounds. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to grief anything, so I'm not going to touch any like things. Right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get out and set up my little thing and try to survive on my own first, just to learn the game. You know how it is. You know how it is. But All right. Main pointers, because because can I pick up stuff here in the base? No, I can't. Well, you yeah. can pick up stuff, right? You can right over here. You can pick up some berries and some fiber from these plants just by pressing I, the E button. I yeah. I guess I need the berries just to survive, right? You'll need that for food. Yeah, I can hook you up with a little bit of food if you'd like. No, 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 no. I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay. I'm fine. I'm totally fine, I think. I can just press I now, right? Go into my little menu and just drag the items I want to eat. There we go. And then just press 1. Yeah, you got it, man. You're doing Perfect. it. Can I, can I poop? Can I poop, can I poop now? Yeah. yeah press Z. Nope. Let me see if I'll poop. No, I'm not ready to defecate. I eat more, maybe. There we go. Poop. Just keep eating. Just keep eating them. See what happens. Oh, crap. I almost dropped all my items on you. <laughs> Alright, so there you go. Oh! A torch. It's the most basic of the basic. Let me just drag it here. Can I light it on? Oh, Look at that, man! Amazing. Now you have light! Oh, now dude. It, it has durability. It wears Lit. out. But you can, you okay. can use this base if you want. Any of the items that are in here, you're more than welcome to just use them. Don't no. worry about it. They're just community. Yeah, but the thing is that I'm, I'm just afraid that I will destroy them, and it's gonna be the Psycho Monkey Balls. I don't want to destroy any stuff. Oh, there's a little thing here. Can I go up here? No more five-hour Mammoth Tames. Hey, what are you doing, man? I'm gonna open the gates. Knocked you out! I knocked you out! <laughs> can you, it's can over you? for you, man! <laughs> Get knocked I out, Corrales! Let me go ahead and drag your dead body around. You start a fight with the wrong guy, man. Dude. Oh, where'd you go? That was a nice. I'm I'm dead. Oh, I can spawn on beds now. Okay. Oh, I may have dragged you through the through the ground and then you died. Oh no! And I'm gonna be learning the game. It's gonna be a noob guide to this game. It's gonna be a but whole I'm, new world. But I'm level two, so don't take that for granted. Hey, Bad don't guy. make me knock you out again. <laughs> Catch me, fatty. <laughs> fatty? Oh, crap, I'm hot. Find a place to cool down. Ooh, do, 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 do. <laughs> Dude, come on. Come on. What? What? I'm not going to hurt you. Don't, don't, don't chase me. I'm not going to knock you, you out again. You got like billions of stamina. I have nothing. Oof. <laughs> <laughs> Look at me dodging here. I'm not trying to shoot you. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Um. <laughs> Dude, I think you have a problem, Corrales. I think you have a slight problem. <laughs> Did this disappear? Hold on, let me make it symmetrical. There, now you're like even. <laughs> Thanks, dude. Oh, no! You passed out! You're knocked out, Corrales. Oh, you're all shaking. Um, let me try to get some stim berries and wake you back up again. You'll wake up here in a second, anyway. Flip. Flip on me. Alright, hold on. I want to really bad. Oh, God. Uh, I can't poop. Education right. Educational purposes. I can't. It won't let me. I'm waiting. Maybe if you crouch. <laughs> I'm trying. I really want to. More than anything. Hold on. Let me eat some other things. Why? Why? Why don't I have to poop? This is the worst thing ever. <laughs> Who? You never get this opportunity. Somebody says, "Just poop on me, man," and you're like, "Oh, yeah, but I can't right now." Like, who? You know. This is a once in a lifetime. Once in a lifetime. I'm, I'm still waiting for it, though. Don't oh worry about gosh. it. Oh, my gosh. Relax your uh, muscles. Uh, 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 I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. Give it to me, Slip. <laughs> 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 so, so gross. Oh, two men. Two grown-up men. Pooping. 
Oh, dude, it was fun, though. It was fun. Thank you so much for showing me everything, dude. Yeah, no problem at all. If you if you have any questions, let me know. Don't no. don't forget to fall yeah. back to the base if you need a safe haven because this place is unforgiving. Oh. Are you checking out his twigs and berries? Yeah. Yeah, he's like, oh, he just crapped in his face. <laughs> <laughs> He's what like, I'll teach have? you. Looking How around the get a doo doo level fifty seven doo doo. <laughs> he's our he's a doo doo. Can can you ride a doo doo? No, you can't ride him. You can't ride those guys. And we're back from that <laughs> silliness. I hope you had fun, guys. It was kind of really like a good time to have somebody just brand new, like Kraus's first time on the server ever. Never had played Ark before, and of course, just like all of us, he was extremely interested in the pooping. So, oh, I'm not ready to defecate. That would have been great defecational punctuation. But anywho, so I was trying to think about what we are going to do as far as getting Chuck back to the base. <laughs> I know, I know. He's excited, man. He wants to go. And I was like, ah, we could do this. We could do Beak Hole, and we could have him, or um, uh, Foul Mouth, and we could have him follow us and all that. But you know what I think, really, it's just time for? I think it's time... For another dinosaur train. It's just a one dinosaur dinosaur train though. Like dinosaur training. It's dinosaur training. So we're going to take Chuck. And we're going to walk him all the way over to the new base. Let's do it peeps. And we're back, and we got Chuck back to the base, and I gotta tell you guys, this guy is really, really fun. Like, he's only level 20, he got two levels on the way over here, and um, I actually unfortunately lost a little bit of footage that I was going to show you guys, um, where he fought um, six trikes at once. Oh, that's totally sweet, Chuck just took a Chuck crap right inside my house. What do you got to say for yourself, man? Look at me. Look at me when I'm talking to you. Look over here now. Now look over here. Chuck, don't poop in the house if you can help it. I know, sometimes I do it too. So, anywho, so we took on six trikes at once. And they weren't just low level. They were like 40, 60, 70. Um, you know, he got down to about half health at that time. You can see he's a little bit damaged. But, um, yeah, six strikes on a level 20 guy, like, it seemed to be pretty unbelievable. He does a ton of damage. A ton of damage. Melee damage is at 221%. But, again, you guys know on Ark, we don't know what the base stats are. We only have these percentages to go off of. So I'm not really sure, but I can tell you that I think a level 100 plus um, Giganto would just be absolutely and completely devastating piece. Check it out, man. We're like twinsies. But yeah, so I had a great time getting Chuck today, and then we hung out with Corrales and had some shenaniganry go on. So yeah, that's what we're going to do today, and I think it was I think it was great. I had a great time. I hope you did too. If you guys liked the video, please don't forget to hit your like button and show your support. Feel free to share it, favorite it as you see fit. We gotta find you a friend, Chuck, a very high-level friend, and smash everything's face with it. All right, peeps, and may the stuff and things be with you. I'm out. 
Go this way. There's a wall. And my crotch. 